Um, as at May, at least, I think you've indicated already, you were, you were fully cognizant of the fact that there would be a public inquiry, yes? Yes. Um, and in August 2021, you, had, you announced that there would be one? Yes. Uh, you knew at the time when you made the statement announcing the Scottish COVID inquiry that uh, material uh, which you had used to exchange uh, messages, informal communications, uh, would assist in the very important aims uh, of the inquiry, scrutinising the decisions that you took? Yes. And you knew at that point that those messages had been destroyed? Uh, I had... I knew, yes, that I had operated in line uh, with a policy uh, that I had operated in line with and advice that I had had from the outset of my time as a minister uh, to ensure that uh, conversations with uh, others in government with any uh, impact or, or relationship to government business shouldn't be kept on a phone that could be lost or stolen, but properly recorded. And I was very cognizant of and had been from the start of the pandemic, so not just at the, the points in time uh, that you are referring to from the start of the pandemic, of my duty to ensure that anything of uh, salience, uh, relevance, substance to the decision making of the government would be properly recorded through the Scottish Government record. Thank you. Um, you were asked a question by a journalist from Channel 4, um, it, it, where he, he asked you at, at that very press conference in August 2021, Scottish Government has a patchy record of disclosing evidence when asked to do so. Can you guarantee to the bereaved families that you will disclose emails, WhatsApps, private emails, if you've been using them, whatever, that nothing will be off limits to the inquiry? You responded, I think if you understand statutory public inquiries, you would know that even if I wasn't prepared to give that assurance, which for the avoidance of doubt I am, then I wouldn't have the ability. The, he asked specific questions about informal means of communication, including WhatsApps, uh, but you knew by that stage that your WhatsApps had been destroyed. But I also knew that anything of any uh, relevance or substance from any of that material uh, would be properly recorded in the Scottish Government system um, and indeed uh, would have been communicated in all likelihood uh, by me uh, through the, the daily uh, media briefings that I gave. Uh, the importance, uh, in my view, is making sure that the inquiry has at its disposal all of the evidence underpinning uh, the decisions as well as the decisions we were arriving at. I operated uh, from you know, 2007, uh, based on advice, uh, the policy that uh, messages, business relating to government should not be kept on a phone that could be lost or stolen and insecure in that way, but properly recorded uh, through the system. I, I would want to, again, uh, underline that in, in my case, uh, that communication uh, was extremely limited, and I do not... Uh, I you know, would not relate uh, to matters of substantive government decision-making. 